All right, now that we got our drawer constructed, we need to build the supports to hold this in place. So if I slide this drawer in here right now, it's gonna wobble from side to side and it goes all the way to the back. So a couple things are gonna help us support that. Number one, we need side sliders on here. So we're gonna do that first. So how I do this is I'm gonna push this drawer all the way tight against one side. So I have it tight. And then I'm gonna come over and I'm gonna measure the opening on this side. So right now I'm at uh, just above an inch and a quarter. And I want a little bit of wiggle room. So I'm gonna divide an inch and a quarter by two, and I'm gonna come up with five eighths of an inch. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut a couple pieces. These are just scrap pieces I found. I made sure that they were at least under the opening. Uh, these are just scraps, so these are about eight and a quarter. It doesn't really matter, my opening's almost 10. So these work, I just want them tight against the front. So I plane them down to five eighths of an inch. I'm gonna set one on each side here. The same thing on this side and now you can see just doing that in there it's pretty tight there's a little bit of wiggle room which you want because it's going to swell and shrink a little bit throughout the seasons so that's pretty good right there so i'm going to pull this out and i'm just going to grab some glue and i'm going to pull it on the side and i'm just going to put a little bead of glue on the side and one on the bottom i don't want to put too much that's going to seep out the side and i'm going to bring it all the way to the front and I'm just gonna push it in place. Do the same thing on this one. And I'm gonna put that one tight in place. Now I wanna keep this drawer out of there until that glue dries, because if any seeps out, your drawer bottom may get stuck to it. So for now, I can just set my drawer off to the side. That's the support for the sides, pretty easy. And then I want a support for the top, because if I put this drawer in here, this top, it can open this way. So I want to stop that from opening. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure. I'm going to use a steel ruler and I'm going to go off to the side because in the middle here, it could be bent either way. So I'm going to come all the way to the edge and it's nine and three quarters is what I want to make that cut to. So I just grabbed another piece of scrap out of the scrap wood, cut my length at nine and three quarters. And then I, this top rail piece is an inch and a half wide. So I want this to be the same thickness as that. So I'm gonna slide that in there. I'm gonna make it even with the top. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna glue and nail both sides of this. Now, the back sits a quarter inch above. So what I do is I use a steel ruler and I set it on there. And then when I put this on, I can raise it until it hits the bottom of that ruler and I know where to nail to. If I nail even with the top up here, then this is gonna sit off balance. When I go to put my top on, it's not gonna fit. So it needs to be as low as the sides are. So use that steel ruler. So I'm gonna go ahead, dab a little glue on this and this side. And I got inch and a quarter nails right now in here. And I'm just gonna put that in place. I'm just gonna eyeball the center from side to side. It doesn't really matter. You just wanna get it nice. And I'm going to put two nails. And the reason I'm putting two and not just one is so it doesn't twist, because now it keeps it from twisting. I'm gonna set my ruler on this, and then I'm just gonna raise this up until I hit the bottom of that ruler. And I'm gonna go ahead and put two more nails in this. Okay, now this is strong, I can lift this whole project up with that. Okay, that will never be seen or used. Now I'm gonna carefully slide this in because I just glued this not too long ago. I don't wanna hit those, but I'm gonna show you what that supports that did for both sides. So we can see it doesn't wiggle from side to side and now it catches it so it won't fall out. I can pull this drawer and it's never gonna fall out now because of this top support. That's how we do the top support of our drawer and our side supports.